Good day class, I'm your teacher in Napa 7, Mrs. Lorraine and Ardi Pusoy. So today I'm going to teach you on how to make a fishda. So this fishda is your performance in arts for this quarter. So what are the materials that you will be needing to make this? So first, kailangan nyo na two different colored paper, a glue, ruler, pencil, and a scissors. So for the first procedure, you will need to cut these colored papers na ang sizes ay 11 inch, so 11 inches, and yung width naman niya, or yung lapad naman niya, is half inch. Again, yung haba is 11 inches, 11, ayan, and then yung lapad is half inch lang. So, nag-prepare na ako dito ng ginawa kong mga cut na paper. So, ito yung itsura nun. Ayan. So, tatlo daw. Teklong blue and tatlong color pink. Ayan. So, the first procedure is you have to fold this paper or strips into the middle. So, sa gitna, ipofold. So, lahat yon ipofold into the middle. So, you're going to fold six pieces of colored papers. So, ang ginamit kong colors ay color blue and pink. So, ang pinafold ko ngayon ay tig tatlong peraso ng pink and ng tatlong peraso ng blue. Okay. okay, so the second step is alternately place the ribbons using the over and under technique. Or sa madaling salita, magahabi tayo nitong mga ating strips of paper. So, paano nga ba gawin yun? So, kunin muna yung isang um, pirasong colored paper. So, again, dapat yan nakafold sa middle. And then, Again, using the over and under technique. Ayan. Nakikita naman. So, next, dapat pare-parehong magkakatabi yung color pink. Pare-pare naman dapat magkatabi yung color blue. So, using the over and under technique. Ayan. So, nakita naman natin, di ba? Yung pink is nasa harapan. O, I mean, dito, harapan. Then, naging blue naman. So, next naman natin na gagawin is dapat, ano yung ka-alternate niya? Color pink dapat naman yung makikita dito. So, gagawin nyo lang yan hanggang sa matapos ang procedure. Okay, so tapos na natin ilagay ang lahat ng color pink. Pero bago natin ilagay yung iba pang strips of blue color ng um, paper, lagyan maglagay muna tayo ng konting blue para at least hindi gumalaw-galaw yung strips of paper natin habang nilalagay natin si color blue. So, kahit konti lang. Ayan. And then, ilagay na natin si color blue using the over and under technique. Oops. Ayan. So, nakita nyo naman. So, ayan, mali. So, ibig sabihin, kailangan nyo i-adjust ang strips ninyo. Ayan. So, ganun lang ang gagawin hanggang sa matapos ang procedure. Nandito na tayo sa last part ng paglagay ng color blue strips. Last one. Ayan, nakikita nyo na ginagamit ko ang over and under technique. Ayan. Okay. And then, yung huli na. Okay. 
So, yan. May kita natin na tama yung pagkakalagay. So, naka-overlap sila sa isa't isa. Sa likod, dapat ganito rin. So, lagyan na natin lahat ng dulo ng glue para make sure na hindi sila maghihiwalay. So, again, konting dulo lang ilalagay para hindi uh, messing tignan. Okay. So, after nyan, get your scissors para gupitin itong nasa gitna. So, dapat ganyan na magiging itsura nyan. Yan. So, gupitin natin yung nasa gitna. Okay, let's cut it. Okay. So, then... Okay, so, nagupit na natin. And then, yung dalawang natitirang part is gugupitin natin na parang for fish or parang pa uh, pabuntot yung itsura. Buntot and karistis. So, dito medyo mas mahabang part. Ayan. And then, ayan. So, ganun lang din yung gagawin dito sa kabila. So, there you go. This is our fish da. And, hopefully, nakasunod kayo sa ating procedures. Again, this is your teacher in MAPE 7, Mrs. Lorraine and Ardy Pusoy. Thank you for watching. Goodbye!